So I really can't express enough to you all how important it is to plan out your semesters, planning out everything from your class schedules to your upcoming exams, to taking the syllabus that your professor gives you and for tests, online homework assignments, just planning it all out. So when you have extracurriculars and other things that you need to intertwine in your schedule, you know how to plan it around certain major upcoming events that you have to take care of that are really important. Organization is really key in college and so that's why I'm doing this plan with me video because I want to make sure that I set and start my last semester off to a good note. I mean I've been doing this all the time anyway to plan out my semesters but this time I'm doing something different where I'll actually be inputting my class schedule into my online electronic calendar which I use an app called iStudies Pro which is an app that basically schedules your whole entire day once you put it in and with the semester and then I'm also going to use my traditional planner that I will write down my assignments my test dates and stuff and I'll incorporate some of those class dates for major classes into this as well planning is very very essential and I would definitely recommend you all if you haven't already please go out and get a planner because you need to stay organized and stay on top of your schedule and it will increase your productivity on another level that was like the one thing like the one thing being organized and having a plan those are that just that's what you need in college for real all right let's get started so i got this planner right here from target actually it was kind of it was very difficult to find a decent calendar a uh, decent planner in target that wasn't like too feminine like most of them were all feminine this one is kind of like i wasn't i was kind of iffy about it but like it, it, it can do it's whatever I'm not, I'm not that pressed about it so i'm i already kind of put in some dates for january the first day of class is the 28th um but i'm right now about to put in some information for my class schedule into my ipad that i will be using i'm currently working on using iStudies pro to basically input all my classes into my online calendar and then i'll be able to get push notifications when i have them so i'm going to show you all how i use iStudies pro to input my course dates okay so i'm going to set up a new semester <clears throat> Spring semester 2019 starts January 28th and will end. I'm not exactly sure on the end date, but it's sometime in May. So let's do the 20, the 20th, whatever. Okay, and then I'll do new new course course ma'am fizz which is b side 440 Class, class meets on Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. So Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, no Saturday. It's a regular type of class lecture. Memphis is basically a bio class where you learn about the human body. It's like anatomy and physiology, but a little bit more intense, a little bit more uh, in depth of information. So this is gonna be a very tough class. A lot of people say it's like intense load. It really is like comparable to med school, like a med school anatomy class. And what I'm really happy is about that we get to do surgery on a rat in lab. So I'm really looking forward to do that. Repeats once a week. Build in ESJ. Room 1224. Instructor, I don't really need to put that. So that's there. Let's add 
discussion. Discussion meets on Monday. Just Mondays. And it's a discussion. Discussion is basically where we meet in our seminar and we basically go over with the information that was taught during the lecture. So with this class, we not only just have a lab and lecture, but we also have a discussion. Discussion is from 2 p.m. to 3.50. That's a long discussion. Like, why, why do we need to be in discussion for that long? Sheesh. And then, meets on Wednesdays so our lab just part portion meets on Wednesdays from 2 to was that 550 damn that's a long class that's a long lab to see like I'm gonna be in class all day 2 p.m. to 5.50. Sometimes lab doesn't run the whole entire time, so that's the good part about it. So hopefully this lab doesn't take the whole time. But it's probably be some days where we'll be in there for the whole time. So that's in there. So we have discussion lab and lecture from Memphis. And now let me do my next class. to go here at course the next course is <clears throat> endocrine endocrine this is b side 441 zero, zero, two. So I go, now I'm in endocrine. And so basically for endocrine, now I can add my classes, hit the new class tab and class meets, class meets once a week. Class meets twice a week and I wrote the wrong number. So it's B side four forty seven. And then class meets twice a week, Tuesday and Thursday. Tuesday and Thursday. And this um it's just lecture. Twelve fifteen. 
10 p.m. So I had to redo my lab portion for the Memphis because I realized that the lab also has a discussion. So I want to separate it from the class portion. So now I'm doing its own section for it. So lab has its own thing. So that goes from two to five p.m. or was that 5.50? So now that's there. Discussion. Discussion is one PM. Add in another course. Another course that I'm taking is my public health science capstone, my capstone class, last and final class that I gotta take for my major. And that class meets once a week, Tuesdays. Business class, 461M.
Okay, cool. And then. I have, what else I need to do? And then I need to add one more class, which will be my NES equals. And this class meets once a week. ESJ. So now I have all, so now I have all of my, so now I have inputted all of my classes into my schedule, into my iStudies Pro calendar. So now you'll be able to see how everything is all lined up basically in the calendar. I give you a nice overview. So let me go and show you what my overview would be like. So this is what my overview would be on my Monday. My Monday is pretty packed, as you all can see here, with Memphis NES, which is an engineering class, Memphis Lab. Wait, no. Okay, so now everything is inside my calendar, my planner for iStudies Pro. So now you can see a big overview of what my semester of classes will look like. So basically I took my schedule that I get online from my school and then I input into my essays pro calendar. And here it is, this is what a week would probably look like for um, my semester here, which it looks correct right now. So that's gonna be a busy week. And then everything's input into my calendar. So that's pretty much me planning right now. Um, when the semester starts, I'll be adding more information and I'll be able to continue this video and do another one where I actually sit down and input the test dates for certain classes. But I really think it's important to make sure you start the semester off with getting a good planner or getting some type of online planner. Some people use Google Docs, the Google Calendar, because it syncs to your phone easily. iStudies Pro, it syncs to the phone easily. I, it goes to my iPad, it goes to my iPhone, and it's on my laptop as well. So it's really easy to streamline, streamline it and to use it on all my devices to make sure I get my notifications when I have classes or assignments that are due. So once I get my syllabus during first week of classes, I'll do a new video updating you all on how I incorporate my test dates, upcoming major assignments, and put them into my calendars and so I can be prepared and notified when those things are approaching. I hope you all enjoyed this video and I catch you on the next video. Peace.